All right, everyone. So for those of you who watched my Deck of Scarlet video where I used the Sandra Deluxe and Deck of Scarlet collab, you know all about Deck of Scarlet. But for those of you who don't know, Deck of Scarlet is a subscription service where you receive this palette and inside it has two lip colors, two cheek colors, three eyeshadows, and two pencils. That's a lot of stuff. It's really awesome. So the subscription service is $29.95 every two months and every other month you get a really sleek palette like this. There's free shipping within the US. You can cancel anytime if you don't like the palette, if you're not a fan of the colors and you wanna cancel, you can totally skip on that particular palette. Shipping is available to Canada and the UK as well. And every palette is 100% cruelty free, paraben free and made in the USA. So this is the collab with Yvonne Wobb. And I think this is so exciting. She picked very unique unique shades and I think they're all really beautiful. I have never seen some of these color combos before. So every other month, Deck of Scarlet collabs with a YouTuber to create a palette and I think that's so cool. They collaborated with Yvonne. If you guys would like to get this look that you see right here and see how I created it, then please keep on watching. So I've already primed my lids with some concealer and I'm gonna jump right into the shade Sunshine. And Sunshine is a beautiful orange. I'm just gonna use this like on a fluffy brush and pop this into the crease. Just starting towards the outer V of my eye and working this in. This shade is so beautiful. This is very spring. And as I'm doing this, I'm just kind of leaving the lid blank. So now I'm gonna pick up the shade Halo and Halo is a really pretty shimmery highlight, but I'm actually gonna use it on my eyes. I'm first gonna wet my brush. I'm just gonna wet my brush a little bit. I'm just concentrating this on the center of the lid. This is a very beautiful gold color, kind of like a champagne gold. Now I'm gonna pick up the Long Wear Eyeliner in Chameleon, and this is a really pretty kind of like a green color. I'm gonna use this in the outer corner of my eye. I'm just gonna kind of draw along the lash line. Now I'm gonna pick up the shade Fudge, and Fudge is like a dark brown. And I'm using this on a really small brush and I'm just going to smudge this in the outer corner of the eye to just add some definition. Adding in the shade Fudge just really gives a lot of extra definition to your eyes so they don't get lost in the orange. Just going back into Sunshine, adding a little bit more of that and kind of bringing it out. Taking the eyeliner in Chameleon, I'm gonna line my waterline with this. And I'm also gonna be sure to kind of drag this along the lower lash line so we can smudge this out a little bit. So now I'm gonna pick up the shade Mermaid, which is a green, it's really pretty, definitely like a mermaid, and I'm gonna smudge this on the lower lash line. And I'm gonna be sure to concentrate this more towards the outer corner, and I'm just gonna lightly bring it in. So now going back into the shade Halo, I'm gonna apply this into the inner corner of my eye. And now I'm just gonna pop on some mascara and some really fluffy false lashes, and we can move on to the face. Now moving back to the face, we're gonna pick up the shade Sandstorm. This is one of the cheek colors. And I would definitely say this is like a contouring color. It's a very cool toned. It's a very good color to really contour and shape your face with. So I'm using this on a really small brush. I'm gonna tap off the excess and then I'm gonna go in and contour my cheeks. I'm gonna go right in front of my ear and just bring this forward about that much. And as you can see, it gives a really nice kind of shadowy color that looks a lot like a real contour would look. So you wanna be pretty light with this or else it could look a little intense, but this is like the perfect contouring powder. You could take a little bit of this and add it to like the base of your hairline. It kind of gives you like a sun-kissed look as well if you do this. And also along my jawline. Ooh. Wow, that just blends really nicely. I'm gonna pick up that same color on a smaller kind of angled brush and I'm gonna use this to contour my nose. I like to start kind of by front of my brow and I just bring it straight down. Because there isn't a blush in this palette, I'm gonna get a little creative and I'm gonna pick up the shade Sunshine. And Sunshine was the orange we used on our eyes. We're gonna use it on our cheeks. I have quite a bit of this on this brush and I'm just gonna go in and tap this on the cheeks. It definitely works. And you know what? You could probably take this color and use it to warm up your whole face. I love to take colors like this and just kind of dab it around the nose where you would normally get like sun. I'm first gonna spray my face before we highlight. This is a great trick for getting your highlight to really pop. So we're gonna pick up Halo and Halo is the highlight. And I self tan so this should look really good on my skin. Okay, and now we're gonna get the nose of course. Our chin. Keep its bow. This highlight is really, really beautiful. I'm gonna take some more of it and I'm just gonna hit this area where, you know, the light would normally hit. It's gonna highlight right above the brow. So we're moving on to lips. I'm gonna line my lips with the Longwear Lip Liner in Cake Pop. 
This is a really nice neutral color. So there's two lip colors and I'm first gonna go into Coral Kisses. And this looks super vibrant. All right, so this is Coral Kisses. I love this color, it's so pretty. I think it looks really good with this look, especially if you're really wanting to use the orange on your eyes, the shade Sunshine. This looks really good paired with that and you could honestly wear those two by themselves and they look really good. Another shade in here called Almond and Almond is a little bit darker. I'll show you guys what Almond looks like. Almond is a little bit more like a chocolate nude. This is also a really beautiful color. It's like a chocolatey nude. I like that it really complements the warm tones. There's a lot of really warm tones in this palette that I really like. They make me think of summer. It's just like a very summery type of palette. I love it. All right, beauty, so this is the finished look using the Deck of Scarlet Yvon Wob palette. I loved it. I think it's very unique, and you guys should totally check it out. If you want any info on Deck of Scarlet, I will have all of the information about it in my description box. And if you guys like this look, don't forget to like this video and let me know what you thought of it down below in the comments. Subscribe, share with friends. You know the drill. Thank you all for watching today, and I will see you all in my next tutorial.